Remember, kids, what the fuck? don't do drugs, or you'll be attacked by fish with giant bombs on their faces. <laughs> <laughs> well, the game's like it, it, it's like 15 years old. She'd be like what in her 20s by now. Okay, okay. Uh, I've seen that in children. She has nice. No. Anyway, um, if you want to date Aerith, you should say, "Let's hope so," because Marlene ships you on Aerith. Uh, if you want to date Tifa, you should say, I don't know. And then she calls you stupid. <laughs> <laughs> and since I, want to well, she's kid. since I want to avoid the harsh judgment of a little girl, I'm going to say, <laughs> let's hope so. <laughs> uh, but yeah, like, every time you talk to her, she says the same thing. So if you, if you say, uh, I don't know, then she just leans forward and goes, stupid! <laughs> stupid! <laughs> it's really quite funny, but anyway... <laughs> Stupid. You're stupid. <laughs> you stupid! I will hit a child! <laughs> I'll kill all your dogs! <laughs> what is that oh, from? Man. Oh my gosh. It's from Strong Bad Email. I say that all the time. Anyway. <laughs> We that's all, right. Oh, that's so long ago. We were all laughing, so we missed the wonderful sound of Barrett just like rumbling down the stairs. <laughs> like, we couldn't rumble, hear rumble, it anyway. Rumble. Yeah, I know. Just redo the sound effect with your voice. That's what I just did. <laughs> yeah. As Do it again. We were we were, were we, we were paying attention again. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we're gonna right. save Earth. Viper. Nice. How did she get Molly out then also? Um, she took Marlene back to her house where the Shinra caught her. But wasn't she on a helicopter? Yeah, they. That, she was on the helicopter after they caught her. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> okay, we got to the pillar. It's hard Me, okay. okay, Cloud and Tifa and Aerith got to the pillar. And Wedge right. fell off and died. <clears throat> and, uh, we were like, oh, that sucks. And Tifa's like, Aerith, there's a little girl in a bar here, and that bar's gonna be destroyed, so please save the little girl. And Aerith was like, okay, I'll do that. And she took off, and me and Tifa climbed the tower, and we fought Reno. And then the thing, the, the support beam came down, you know, the the, the support came down, and then uh, it's, Death Aerith, Aerith was in a helicopter. So during the time that we climbed the tower and fought Reno, um, Aerith went to the bar, got Marlene, brought her home, and then Sung was like, hey, I'm going to kidnap you now. Previously. And dinner. she was like, "Okay." Well, she, she yeah, she she wanted. Him. She was like, "Okay, I'll go with you if you, you know, let if you leave the girl alone and whatever." And now, uh, Barrett and Tifa feel guilty that she got kidnapped because they she was looking after Barrett's daughter at Tifa's request. Um, so we're gonna go save her now. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna, yeah, yeah. Fine. All right. Let's, let's save her. So what does Kate Sith have to do with all of this? Oh, you'll find out, my friend. We're not even out of Midgar yet. <laughs> but it's Kate Sith. Spoilers. This little oh jumping my god, it's a hell house. Run for your lives. <laughs> <laughs> you Abort. took this guy down no problem last time. I know. <laughs> He's got nothing to steal. Huh. In the entire house? Of hell? <laughs> I know, right? You think he would have at least some valuables in there? <laughs> some silverware, maybe. A house maybe a little is just a place to keep all your stuff. Whoa! So sad job. That's not a house. I know. <laughs> when I was a kid, this thing horrified me. Dude, look at all these limit breaks. I got limit breaks out the yin yang. <laughs> <laughs> Also, I gave Aerith that sweet staff, and now, like, I don't even. She's. I don't even get to use her for the next. hour. Game? No. <laughs> for the next game? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. <laughs> right you are, Ken. <laughs> Spoilers. Giant robot hand. Just sitting out there for no reason. Oh, hey. Alright, I'm not gonna fight you then. Later! And yes, Kate Sith is supposed to be pronounced Ketchy. But, uh, who gives? Who what? Gives it's, Does anybody it's pronounce gonna, it that way? I've never heard anybody. Make them hardcore fans. It's Gaelic. I've, so, yes. Angry. 
It's supposed well, to be words is, yeah, I don't sign the instruction manual. Yeah. It's Kate's I've a, never heard anybody in my entire life call him that. It's Gaelic, so yes, it's uh, technically the official pronunciation would be Ketchy, but I don't give two fucks. Hmm. I don't even give one. <laughs> I don't even give half of one. Oh Whoa. my god, this vending machine just tried to murder me. Okay. Yeah. Oh, and Cloud's <laughs> suicide booth from Futurama. Cloud's only retort is broken. <laughs> well, that's not wrong. Hit <laughs> it with your giant sword. Yeah, it might be a bit of an understatement, but he's not wrong. Maybe <laughs> chuck one of your 30 grenades at it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 36 <laughs> grenades, thank you. Oh. Oh, this is just—it's just like that Stephen King movie where all the like cars came to life and like there was a vending machine that was just shooting shit at people. Does anybody know what I'm talking about? Probably not. Uh, I hope this these cars. No. <laughs> That's not a Stephen King. Movie. I know. I the, saw Christine, uh, but I, I remember. No, 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 no not shot. Christine. Not Christine. It's an—it's another one. It's like, uh, yeah, I think it was like a maybe it was a made-for-TV movie or something. But didn't ACDC like do the soundtrack for it? Oh, like about like mo like oh. huge ass like eighteen wheelers or some shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The eighteen wheeler had like a clown face on the front of it or something, like a or the yeah. Green Goblin's like face or something. Yeah, like yeah. there's a there's a scene where this like vending machine at a gas station just goes fucking berserk and starts <laughs> like trying to kill the main dude. <laughs> but does it have a machine oh, gun? Man, I've never heard of that at all. Uh, no, but there there is in that scene there is like a tank thing that has a machine gun trying to attack. <laughs> in that same scene because, you know, the vending machine <laughs> trying to kill him was not enough. <laughs> oh, some guy was getting tortured while we were talking about some movie. That was going <laughs> to be fucking insane until I realized what it is. That was Don Corneo's minion, Koch. Uh, saving him is optional and offers you no rewards, but uh, <laughs> it's a thing in the game hmm. that you can do. Yes, it is. I, mean, I yes, don't know about you, is. but I don't know too many words that start with A V E R L E. <laughs> Everls. A. Wait, it's a verl. Okay. okay. Averls. Averls. <laughs> I think it's supposed to be avalanche, but it's like they fucked up the. <laughs> It's like Avalanche. Yeah, well, because Avalanche is the name of our, you know, uh, yeah. we're basically a terrorist cell. I what? Guess. But, uh. It's A V A L A N C H E, actually. Yeah, but it's certainly not A uh, Black Avalanche. <laughs> Avalanche. <laughs> Avalanche. Maybe that's what the A in Avalanche does. They got Come no, on, Black Betty. They got Avalanche. no mercy right, though. Oh, my God. And they're Bo 11. Come on, Black Betty, Everledge. We're uh, climbing up a bunch of scary wires to the plate because uh, the trains. You know, we're terrorists, so the trains aren't going to let us up there. Yeah. Uh, the movie was called Maximum Overdrive. I, uh, uh, because I had to know. <laughs> I, don't know if, I don't know if you saw me buy batteries from that guy, but you have to do that to uh, get up this part. So I bought some batteries. Now you uh, know. I probably should have mentioned that, but you guys were talking about maximum overdrive. So <laughs> <laughs> it was important. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Far more important than your battery story. <laughs> well, that battery didn't last long. Nope. Battery didn't last long at all. I want my money back. What kind <laughs> of battery was that? <laughs> but it moved the. Uh, I, don't, I didn't actually need to go up there. I don't know why I did. But it moved the fan enough so that we can use it as a bridge now. Let's see. Mm. So. I see. You know, I should know all this stuff, but it's been like 18 years. 18 years. Yeah, I thought 18 you just played it for the first time, like, recently. Yeah. Not too recently. Like, five years ago, maybe. <laughs> yeah, that's like 18. <laughs> <laughs> I was being facetious. <laughs> you were just being wrong. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are Oh, use the OK button to jump. Which one's the OK button on the yes button? Control? Well, by default in this game it's circle, but I changed it to X because I'm a stupid. I'm a Baka Gaijin. But, uh... <laughs> oh, you're a what? It's a Baka yeah. Gaijin. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't. I don't speak. It means stupid foreigner. Like, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, 
Um, <laughs> my mind went to a different place. That, that <laughs> puzzle like where that. You, you have to like jump on that bar, you know? Um, Cloud, the text box, Cloud says to you, I should make it if I jump before it comes too close. But the point where you have to jump is literally when it is at its closest. <laughs> so that's a poor translation for you. Wrong. Good game. <laughs> Climbing up wires. And now because I went took that detour for that ether, I have to do it again. I missed. No. No! I miss saying go too late. I was hoping that I wouldn't get stuck here for an hour like I usually do. <laughs> the first time. Gotta jump before it comes too close. I made it, shut up. <laughs> you guys are jokes. <laughs> Alright, now it's in everybody's hey, heads. Hey guys, what's this? That's the Shinra headquarters. That looks kinda like the building on the box. No, oh, it does. Yeah, it does. No, it does. There ain't no building on the box, <laughs> asshole. I'm looking at the box right now. Oh, it must be different <laughs> in North America. Well, anyway, fucking there's the scene. There's that's the scene. This was on the box. There it is. Cloud's got the sword. That's the building. But Wait, both Barrett and T. Barrett and T. are not on the cover. Maybe there was different box art in different countries. Yeah, clearly there was. Uh -huh. But when somebody edits this video, they're gonna put the North American box art, and they're gonna vindicate nope. me. Oh, nope. what? Nope. Why would you? Why? Because <laughs> <laughs> you did not think that the maximum overdrive conversation was important. <laughs> That's not what I said. I'm I never said. I'm it wasn't skipping important. over everything that you just said. I never said it wasn't important. I said I didn't get to talk about the shop guy because you guys were talking about maximum overdrive. I added no further commentary. There was no me saying, and that was retarded. I just <laughs> said the facts, man. All right. Well, I hope everybody is enjoying looking at the European box art for. It's quite uh, nice, really. It's minimalistic. Whatever. Anyway, um, you have a choice here, <laughs> and actually, what you pick from this menu does not determine your choice in any way. You can still do whatever the hell you want after this, but basically, you can go in the front door and fight a bunch of random battles, or you can climb the steps, which takes much longer, but is much funnier, and you don't have to fight any battles, and you get a turbo ether, I think. Nice. Or maybe like come come back here like twenty hours That's later and get it. Okay, so open. Yes. Yes. Yeah. But uh, I'm just for the sake of time, I'm gonna bust that in. But I'm gonna say that we're gonna sneak in quietly. <laughs> and then not. Yep. Because you can. You have the freedom to do that. Hmm. This is not what you said we would do. <laughs> I feel lied to. Terrible. Leaves the party. <laughs> no, Barrett, Barrett's the one that wants to break in. Tifa's the one that wants to take the stairs. Well, then Tifa leaves the party. There. Yeah, I don't get to use Tifa for the rest of the game. Rest in peace, Tifa. <laughs> Alright, here we go. <laughs> Walking right in the front door. Hell yeah. Yeah! You don't have an appointment. I don't need an appointment. I got a gun. Jog! <laughs> gun, you don't need appointments. Try that next time you need to go to the hospital. Oh yeah. <laughs> Don't try this at home. <laughs> <laughs> try it at the hospital. Oh, you're fighting like actual people. Yeah. Yeah. Instead yeah, of like ghosts and <laughs> porcupines. Oh what well, it. if you think pies. if you think that Shinra headquarters is only going to be staffed by actual people, just you wait, my friend. <laughs> Because <laughs> you won't believe. I, didn't say that. I just thought it was a nice change of pace. If I worked Damn. in this building, I would shit my pants every day. <laughs> Are there hell houses? No, but there's like giant like <laughs> saw fish and robots and machine guns and <laughs> crazy monsters. It's, it's a weird. It's it's a, it's an RPG. So it's so just, weird. You just kind of roll with it, you know. It's one of those RPG logic things. But like, wow, there's some stupid stuff in this building. <laughs> Did okay. anyone else notice the machine gun only did 15 uh, damage? 
<laughs> oh, I'm so dumb. I missed the uh, first poster. The truck. It's, it's a good thing I get to come back later. Mm -hmm. Fuck. I missed the first. There's six posters in the game that you could just find. Um, and if you find them all, then you get like a bunch of crazy items in Wutai. Here's the second one. I'll have to come back for the first one later. But yeah. Turtles Paradise. That was it. It was in Sector 6. I was, I believe, in the kid's room with the who gave me the turbo ether. So I'm quite upset that I forgot about it. Because I was in there twice. But anyway, moving on. Game of AQs. <laughs> Damn you, Brady Games. <laughs> <laughs> Sold me out. <laughs> Go to the website, my ass. That's Final <laughs> Fantasy 9. Huh. Yeah. Worst that, strategy, that was guys. Stupid. It's a it's a hundred and fifty pages of uh, going to the website, which is not even <laughs> up anymore. Yep. And I own it. <laughs> that gun did seven damage. Damn, that guy you has terrible. Go to, the, go to the website. Yes. No. Never. There's like a website in like two thousand one or something. Actually, uh, from what I remember, like the strategy guide was just to find out Garnett's real name. <laughs> but it's I'll. Never mind. What if you put okay. in her real name at the oh, start? Glad you, uh, glad you built this, like, screw the game up. I don't know. <laughs> well, like, a lot of people in this game like to name Red 13 Nanaki, so the conversation when you learn his real name is really funny. Uh -huh. I've seen people rename everybody Sephiroth. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Cause that won't get confusing. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking people are trolls. <laughs> Of course. Why wouldn't we be? It's fun. I know. Yeah. I know. Hey, look, she's at Stephen Colbert's Take desk. Take the money. Did it's you say C. she's at Stephen Colbert's desk? Oh, you're funny. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I should be good. She's like, thank you and come again. Oh, wait, forget I said that because she doesn't actually want us here. Haha. <laughs> anyway, let's take the elevator. I'm sure yeah. nothing bad will go wrong. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope it does. In that case. <laughs> this is like the speedrunner's like least favorite part of the entire game because uh, if you're, you have to, it, it, the elevator stops. I think it's like either five or six times, and on every floor you have to fight a battle. But if just randomly, sometimes instead of a battle, there'll just be like an employee who's about to get on the elevator, and he's like, "Ah, oh, I'll get the next one." You know? <laughs> and uh, if you like reset the game enough times, and if you're obscenely lucky enough, you can that can happen to you. In theory, it could happen every time, you know. But uh, because it's random, and speedrunners are all, you know they're of course trying to find the fastest way through the game. They're like, God damn it, I had to restart this part like a million times. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? It's a robot. Which is just a, which is just one of many reasons why I personally think speedrunning an RPG is really dumb. <laughs> this is a mighty grunt. There's too much randomness. Like in a side scroller or even like a 3D like a platform game, like sure, speedrun that shit. I would love to see that. But in an RPG, I just don't. There's Get too it. much there's too much that can go wrong, you know. Was that a move? Which move? The one where he like Exploded. skated in a circle and then didn't do anything? Um probably. He's on, he's on roller blade. blades. Roller braids. He's on roller, roller braids. braids. It really is a JRPG. <laughs> it is. <laughs> I must defeat Avalanche with my roller braids. A finger. Wow. That's horrible. Really. <laughs> you're, the, you're the one who said it. And I was. I was did it on accident. Well, I was doing a callback to that messed up Avalanche graffiti that was like Avalanche. <laughs> Avalanche. <laughs> <laughs> I will play better. Avalanche. <laughs> How come when these guys throw grenades at me, they do 35 damage, and when I throw grenades at them, they do like 100 and change? 149. Because th those they don't have enough badges to train them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll accept that. Big shot. Oh, to the yeah. Fruit. Yeah. I'm grenade man. <laughs> I don't remember what else he said. Crush everyone! Ah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
And of course, my favorite when you kill him. That felt good. Because <laughs> <laughs> he blew up. Is that why? Because he's a he's a grenade yeah, he's man, a so grenade blowing up. Feels good. Okay, so here are um, you know these things. <laughs> what the hell? I don't know about so you, but if you were if you were on an elevator and the doors opened and uh, these <laughs> got on. Fuck is that? Oh, God. I think I would, uh, yeah. <laughs> what are they, sword dance? Oh, man. Can't even get away from sword dance in this game. I know. It'll raise your attack two times! That's right. What if they just wanted to get on the elevator, like, just to get to, like, the next floor? Like, they were just trying to get to work, and you're the one attacking them. Yeah. Well, clearly, that's the case. I mean, <laughs> I just well, got then, two... yeah. I just he got... slapped you. You threw a grenade at him. That's true. That's <laughs> disproportionate retribution. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> I just got two critical hits in a row. Barrett and Tifa both got one. Nice. So that was cool. Because <laughs> they were defenseless, they won't try to hurt you. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> oh, here he is. That's the guy. Oh man. <laughs> no, that's right. My mistake. I'm uh, not getting on. Oh man, <laughs> he just <laughs> runs away. I'm so glad I got to. You got to see that guy, so that you know that I'm not. Oh, uh, that is fantastic. Ricky, you gotta restart now. Because <laughs> I only got him once. <laughs> yeah. No, because you just you you just he ruined your run. You you could have beat the record. But now For he's longest uh, time on the elevator, it's faster to see a guy than it is to fight a sword stance. Yeah, that's that's why speedrunners want to see the guy as many times as possible. Yeah, they want to see the guy. They want to see, see, the see the guy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so fun fact: this is one of many battles in the game where it causes a glitch afterwards. Uh, <laughs> What? Fun it, fact. It is a fun fact, This man. game is bugged to fuck. This game is bugged <laughs> to fuck. It truly really is. Basically, the glitch is this. Anywhere in the game where there is a battle that you can't escape from, like this one, that has a dialogue balloon before it, but not after it, um, any random okay. battles that you run into after this fight will not be able to be escaped from either. So... Like forever? <laughs> well, until you oh. enter the next area. The whole rest of the game? Yeah. yeah, so like, there's only a few places in the game where this happens. This is one of them, uh, Schizo is one of them, uh, there's, there's a few of them, but this is the first one, and I'm mentioning it to you, because that is my job. Hmm. Actually, what my job the... is bug testing, but that's <laughs> What was the text box? Um, it said something like halt intruders or something like that. Yes, there's no there's no option to hold. <laughs> no, you can't just comply and you know, <laughs> be on your merry way. Go to jail. Yeah. yeah, that's that's it. That's the end of the game. You just you give up to these robots early on. They confiscate thirty six grenades for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So there's no dialogue after the thing, even though there is. So that's weird. But anyway, I'm pretty sure if I got into a random battle here, I would not be able to escape it. Cool. But fuck that. Okay, <laughs> 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 you don't have to. Dem you don't have to demonstrate that for us. We'll we'll just take your word. Yeah. <clears throat> it's like walking out. Really walk out. Except it's attached to a building. Like the Willy Wonka elevator. Yep. Well, that that was just some uh, some golden sun right there, where it's like the whole party's basically kept inside your person. Oh man, I guess <laughs> Un yeah. until you need to talk to them, then they all just sort of spill out of you. The whole game is like that. A lot mm -hmm. of RPGs. I mentioned yeah. like my first time playing this game, I had never seen that. So when Barrett just walks into you, I was like, "What? Where did he go? What just happened?" Anyway, what's the game where like? I don't know if it's a group of enemies or whatever. They try and do that, and they just bump into each other. Um, well, <laughs> super they perfect. wanted to do it in this game with Biggs and Wedge and Jesse. That was going to be planned for like development, but they thought it was too goofy or something. So <laughs> they didn't do it. I'm, you might be thinking of that. So oh, I might be. I might be. I think that would have been quite funny. Yeah. They might also have done it in like Chrono Trigger or something, or Xenogears, because those three games were developed like at the same time. 
Look at all those golden busts. <clears throat> Isn't there... Do later Final Fantasies, or do any of the Final Fantasies, like, have them walking no. behind you? I feel like I've yeah. seen it before. In, starting in 8, they walk behind you on the map. Okay, maybe it was 8 that I've seen it in. They follow you, like, yeah. in perfect synchronization. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is another part that speedrunners hate, because, you know, it's easy to fuck up. And it's uh, fuck up. If you do fuck up, not only do you have to do the whole thing over again, but you have to fight a battle as well, so... No, so, you can't just fight uh, four guys yuck. at once. No. So it's like the garden in Ocarina of Time, but it's not. Yeah, basically. <laughs> oh my lord. Two at a time. <laughs> Going ham. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> dun 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 dun. <laughs> Uh, stealth bits, my least favorite part of any video game. Like a boss! Anybody. Did you catch what so I just said? That, that barge in option didn't really pay out too much. What do you mean? Well, your options were sneak in or barge in, and you still had to do the stealth section. <laughs> well, yeah, but the, the sneak in is just you take the stairs, so you don't have to fight any. Anyway. Guys, or things on elevators. <laughs> Where are the other drugs going? <laughs> Why would this guy know? I want to know about bears and rabbits. He thinks we're <laughs> he thinks we're like a custodian or something. So he gave us the key card to the next floor. Thanks, chief. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, smart guy. All right, this is a fun yeah, spiky-haired custodian in purple makes sense. Yeah. John this is fun. This is a fun floor. Minutes. Basically, this guy in this room is the mayor, and he's got the key card, and he'll give it to you because he fuck if I know. But he'll only give it to you if you solve his puzzle. Um, and rather than like tell pay the guy to give me hints on the puzzle, I'm just going to tell you how it works. Uh, there's four libraries here. Each of them has a the theme. The theme for this one is scientific research. There's going to be one book in this library that doesn't match the theme. So find that book. Puzzles. Which is the book that doesn't have to do with science. And they all seem to have to do with science. So. Diminishing mm -hmm. energy, I think. <laughs> yeah. No. Oh, it's gotta be the ancients. It's gotta be the ancients. Ancients? Well, one of these does not have to do with science. So you look at the number 14 and you click. You make note of the 14th letter in this entry. So. You don't have it memorized by now? Let's, the password's randomized every time you play the game, dude. Oh. So I can't. <laughs> I, didn't know. I can't just be like, "Oh, the password is ass," because that's always. The case. <laughs> I, I didn't know, man. I've never played this fucking game. That's all right. Anyway, uh, urban development research. What do we got? Problems. Plate construction. Urban champion. Urban <laughs> Biological characteristics of the ancients. That doesn't have to do with um, urban whatever. So. One, it's a B. Remember the letter B. I don't know what the one in that other library was, but I can guess from context clues. So we got the letter B for sure. Is it BH? So it's Hank Hill? No, we don't. Bad know. Hank? We don't know that yet. Okay. Peace preservation slash weapon development. So, look at this library. Reactor, Tell construction Hank. chart. That doesn't seem, that seems like that should go under urban planning, so it's probably that one, but let's check all the other ones. Yeah. Okay, it was that yeah. one. So we got a B and a T. Okay, so we got B and T, and I already know the password from those B two letters alone, but I will B tell you... I'll, let's look at this other library just for shits and giggles. Space Development Research. Okay. BLTs. Space Program, Space Program, <laughs> Space Development Program, Failed Space Mission... That doesn't have to do with space. Special peacekeeping. Now. Okay, <laughs> so our answer is E. Wait, we they're studying space in this civilization? Sure. Yeah. Space travel. Anyway, yeah. we got a B, an E, and a T for sure. So that H was probably not it. So since apparently I to... back then they had ships that could do that. Yeah. Let's find Genova Project. 
I think, it, I think Josh might have been right. I think it might have been finishing Mako Energy because that would make it an S. Which would make the password best. E. Or STEB. <laughs> well, <laughs> there's only so many options. Yeah. STEB. Or TEBS. <laughs> if, you get or the or pass, if you get the password on the first try, which I'm going to because I'm the boss. Bring couch there, Josh. <laughs> we can we can spell four letter words. <laughs> this is best it's orbs. orbs bomb, uh -huh. I think there's two of these that it, the password is never that. One of them is Hojo, and I think the other one might be orbs, but I'm not really sure. I'm it's pretty orbs. sure. Hold on a second, or wait a second. That's probably the one that never is. Yeah. And, well, anyway, <laughs> it's best. So I got it right. Um, this guy has such a complex that he just likes to think he's the best. So I got his key card, and because I'm a boss, I got elemental materia. Nice. Mm. Is, that, is that good? Yeah. It's very good. <laughs>